is Mike Callahan, Dr. Filefinder, and welcome to part 8 of our special Butterscotch.com 10-part series on Internet Explorer 8. Now in this segment I'm going to take a quick look at the improved favorites function in Internet Explorer 8. They have it running across here, the favorites bar, and a few other browsers like Firefox, it's called the bookmark bar. But this favorites bar is vastly improved. In earlier segments you saw that we could put web slices here. You can see there's an update in traffic for Gallatin, Tennessee. You can click on favorites here and see what you've got. Feeds, favorites, and history. You can also take and do a quick add. So for example, say we want to add butterscotch.com as a favorite. A wise choice. Just click right here on this little star that's got the green arrow on it. Add to favorites bar. Click. And there it is. Added to our favorites. Another thing you can do is add an RSS feed. So we'll click on the RSS feeds link. Go here and say I want to see all the episodes of the A-List with Amber Mack. I can click right here on the little star with the green plus button. Ask me if I want to subscribe. I subscribe. And now if we look in our favorites list under feeds, there it is, the A-List. So we can have these things in our favorites. There's also by default a suggested sites button that brings up sites based on what you've been looking at recently. I've been looking at a lot of stuff pertaining to Tennessee, so there are some suggestions there. If you're in the favorites bar and you right click, you can go down here, you can customize the width so that, for example, I can do icons only, which gives me a lot more room. So as long as you know what the icons stand for, you're doing okay. Or you can have short titles rather than long titles. Here's traffic, there's weather, butterscotch, suggestions. You can also click here and you can refresh all of them. You can delete. So this is the favorites function in Internet Explorer 8 and that concludes part 8.